want to do it quietly? <laughs> right. They're here! They're here! So we're back at it. Uh, this is going to be the start of our Western Games Marathon. Something I decided to go with. I mentioned it at the end of Bounty Hunter. Uh, that I was going to probably be playing Western Games. Well, Wild West specifically. Because I've always liked Wild West games. Um, though it's, it's funny because I've never actually played... I've played this game before uh, back on Xbox 360. So I don't have a save or anything for it. Well, except for the one that I used to test it. But, but I never played the original Call of Juarez. I've only ever played Bounded Blood and Gunslinger, but I played Gunslinger a lot. Um, and then, obviously, Red Dead Redemption and Red Dead Redemption 2. I've played Red Dead Revolver, and then I've never played Gun. I actually kind of started with Red Dead Redemption in terms of Wild West games. It's the one that really made me enjoy them a lot. Uh, that's one of the reasons why I ended up buying more of them. But I, I've always owned different versions of Gun, and I still never ended up playing it. And from the little bit that I did play back in the day, I know I would have loved it. So we're going to be playing through that game uh, during this marathon of Wild West games. Uh, probably get to it after the Call of Juarez series. We're going to be playing Bound in Blood first because it is a prequel to the original game. So we're just going to play it in chronological order. And then after the original Call of Wars, we're going to move on to Gunslinger. And then we'll probably play Gun and then the Red Dead Redemption series, starting with Red Dead Revolver, then playing 2, and then playing the first one just to play it chronologically, even though the, the Revolver is loosely canon, I guess. But yeah, um, we also hit 300 subscribers, so thanks again for all the support. Uh, it's moving faster than I imagined it would, so I'm really grateful for that so we're just going to keep the game and train rolling here uh uh since i never played the pc version of this game before i'm probably going to be getting all of the secrets so i guess i'll just timestamp them as well i don't know if this is really a walkthrough per se because i am just kind of playing through it but i'll be picking up the secrets and then one thing i wanted to start here with is i'm pretty sure we can get some exclusive content with a code here which I think the code is actually universal. I don't think it matters. I don't know if this has to be capitalized or not. Oh, I don't want that. Yeah, there we go. We get some extra money and an exclusive weapon to be used in the first two chapters. And in well, I'm not going to touch the multiplayer. Yeah, it's a neat little code you can use. But I guess we just get right to it. I think there's 89 secrets in total in this game. But yeah, I tested the game out for a little bit to make sure everything was working correctly. Because sometimes with older PC games, you never know. So we're going to start a new game here. so desperately to lead my lost brothers towards the light of the Lord. But I've failed us all. And now my brothers are mortal enemies. Why? For what? A woman? 
Gold, yesterday we were a family. It was late August in 1864, and the murderous Yankee General William Tecumseh Sherman was marching through Georgia, burning everything in his path. Those were bitter days for my brothers and I. My father was dead, killed at Antietam. My mother and I were all alone, doing our best to run what was left of the family farm. Two years previously, I had left the seminary, giving up my religious studies to do my familial duty. Now, everything we held dear was about to burn. Our last hope was the Confederate forces defending the Chattahoochee River. Among those forces were my brothers, Thomas and Ray. Alright, looks like we're jumping in now. Yeah, this game actually looks pretty good on PC for how old it is. Oh, we actually get golden... Oh, is I wonder if this is the one we get for the first two chapters. Because when I played it before typing in the code, it was the same gun, but it wasn't gold-plated. Alright, that's pretty neat. I am using a controller. This game would probably be better with keyboard and mouse, but I don't have a arm for my microphone, so it's just sitting in front of my keyboard. And I didn't want it to, like, bump and make noise. Sir? Sir, Lieutenant Fox needs you on the flank. Yankees are taking the forest. Donovan, get your men. Sir, we spotted them in the trees. Oh, shit. They got past our men at the river. Does Barnsby know? I don't know, sir. But I'm going to have to use keyboard and mouse for the first game anyway, so I guess I'll find out how Here it works. Oh, it's clicking to duck? That's weird. What the hell? I'm like missing by a sliver. I don't know if we can hit those guys. You see that? Sapper, sir. They blew up the fortifications. Damn. Oh, McCall. You got some hell waiting for you. The one thing I will say, though, the PC version. I don't remember if the 360 version was the same. I keep clicking in the stick to sprint, but it's LB. But the audio quality is really goofy. Is this everyone? I got 20 men and shredded fortifications. Fox has eight. Just great. Oh, I thought it wanted me to pick up a rifle at first. Do I have a rifle? No. Oh, come on. Is this everyone? I got 20 men and shredded fortifications. Fox has eight. Just right. Guess we can't let these guys die. What the hell? another wave but those who got through those are yours sergeant sir we have to tell headquarters the enemy could have crossed the river and my brother was there you think this war's about your brother McCall 
Clear out those yanks and secure that area, Sergeant. I'll expect a report. All right, there we go. We defended it this time. I think one. I think someone came over and killed the dude up close. All right, so it's left trigger to shoot. I think our first secret's actually coming up here. Is he invincible? Yeah. Ryan, go to headquarters and tell them we're holding the flank and to counterattack the bridge. Sir? Ah. Oh. Damn it! Take cover! Sniper. Where the hell did that come from? Sons of bitches! I don't have time for this! Can I even get around him here? I think it's all of them. Oh, oh, we got another one. Am I crazy or is running speed almost the same as jogging speed? Oh, I do have a rifle now. I can't even see this guy. Oh, there he is. Perfectly in that tree. Oh, hang on, brother. I'll be there. Just, just hold on. Oh shit! Screw it. I'm not leaving my brother to die. Oh, I can actually see the other revolver that's holstered on in this cool. All right, get through these tents. I think we do have another secret somewhere by tents in this. Yep, yeah, it's right here. Got some cash here. I forgot that you could actually get money in this game. I think you can actually auto flourish your guns too, but maybe he just does it automatically. All right, let's get moving here. Sir? The enemy's punching through the left flank. We need to counterattack now. What are you thinking, McCall? Did you forget how to salute? O'Donnell? Sir, I'm asking for permission to lead the attack. Denied. Their cannons are holding the field. I'll head through the forest. Look, I know that your brother's defending the river, McCall, and I don't want you doing anything stupid. We're pulling back, making a tactical retreat. Return to your unit. Let him go, Captain. Sir. If you can reach the trenches, McCall, I'll hit him with everything I have. Sir, yes sir. Corporal Scott will go with you, McCall. Sir, get your men, Corporal. Follow me. Let's go to the trenches. Got 
rocks falling on us. Right, I think we do have another secret somewhere by this river. Not entirely sure where. Here we go. Oh, is there anything else? I keep seeing the clothes thing, and I think there's something else in there. We're going for the trenches, sir. We gotta attack. Are you crazy? How are we gonna get past their defenses? They're tearing us to pieces. Well, if we can't go through them, let's go around them. I'm not running my men into a meat grinder. Smith. Show McCall the end of their line. He wants to get himself killed, that's his prerogative. This way, sir. Alright. Going on a suicide mission. I wish we could keep these revolvers. Okay, now hold your charge until you see an opportunity. This is like a perfect spot for an ambush. But yeah, I mean, it's been a really long time since I played this game, so I only remember so much of it. Man, the movement reminds me of the darkness, where your running speed is very similar to your normal speed. Whoa, this is really sensitive. Concentration mode, always awesome. Every Western game's gotta have something like that. Am I picking up money from these guys? Oh, I think they can pick up their guns too if I want them. Can I see the name? Okay, we have a rusty classic rifle. O'Brien, get over here. God protects you, McCall. He must have something in mind for you. Maybe he wants us to get these goddamn trenches back. Damn right. Let's go, soldiers. Time to show these blue bellies the business end of our bayonets. Oh, I'm running out of concentration mode time. Okay, I think this is out of range. Just be with enemies in range. What are you talking about? That only is when I have concentration. Nice, got some dynamite. Do I want a shot? Well, we're gonna be in trenches, so probably. Sticky dynamite. <laughs> We're just yelling over each other. Oh yeah, that's right, it had like a dynamic corner cover, instead of having to peek. Come 
miss. There's another secret somewhere down in these trenches. Don't think it's over here though. Why am I losing my vision? Hold on, brother, I'm coming for you. We keep going this way. What's in here? Oh, she would just auto pick up money all the time. I'm stuck. Is that actually? Oh, it actually spends the whole thing, All right? I wasn't sure. All right, our secret's not over here. Oh, I shot his hat off. Got all these goddamn explosions. Alright, I think our secret might actually be hanging a left here. Yeah, here we go. Is there a melee attack? I don't remember. I don't think so. I didn't even try it out the shotgun. Anybody in there? Come on in, find out for yourself, you Yankee piece of shit. Thomas! Thomas! You're late. What? I rigged the bridge, but I can't blow it up because them some bitches took our cannons and control the field. Once the main attack wave comes, we're done for. Barnes, Beal, send more men. They won't make it on time. Look, here they come. Right, take the other Gatling gun. Gatling guns in Wild West games. I'm gonna be using these a lot. Over my dead body, you hear me? Got more coming. The only thing I hate about using Gatling guns is uh, you're kind of just stuck in a position and you can't move or take cover. Might be retreating. Those yanks are getting too damn close. We can't wait any longer, Ray. I'm blowing up the bridge. Corporal! Wait. I'll go. But first, I'll silence these cannons. Hurry up. I'm almost out of ammo. Scott, follow me. Let's go take out this bridge. Dude, I hate when there's so many explosions because it keeps making your screen blurry. <laughs> Damn, what is that one guy using? He's doing a bunch of damage.
of Rusty Classic Rifle. <laughs> Mark him. Where did that come from? Trying to hit that barrel. <laughs> Yeah, my favorite types of gun to always use in a game for pistols is either like magnums or revolver type weapons. That's why Wild West games, I always love them because of the guns. Especially when they're like styled out like this. It's got like an ivory handle. It's plated gold. Come on, how did this guy just die? <laughs> Damn. That almost got me. That's not good. Oh, you can actually click in the right stick to aim as well, that's weird. I can't believe that guy lived through all that. Move out of the way. Got a huge drop off here. Oh, come on. Always a couple feet in front of him. Oh wow, these guys are getting close. that these guys are going to make it. Oh, 
crossing the bridge. Holy shit. Keep an eye on the river. Sir, what do you want to do? Blow this want goddamn you to move. bridge up. All right, we cleared most of them on the cannon at least. I think there might actually be an achievement on the 360 version for eliminating all of them. But it's kind of hard to do that. I remember there were chapter specific achievements on that game. I think the only achievements I never ended up getting were all the PvP ones. Oh, this is a terrible spot to use this. Alright, we've got another secret down by this bridge. Hopefully we can get to it. Here we go. Man, this reminds me of the bridge section in Red Dead Revolver. <laughs> Man, I keep getting stuck on a bunch of stuff. Moving as fast as I can. Yes, we did. Where are those goddamn reinforcements? <coughs> Zan O'Donnell? Is all by himself. Bastard Barnes, we didn't send any goddamn men. Sergeant? I have new orders from Colonel Barnsby. He's calling for a general retreat. But we're holding the line. Why would he want us to back off now? We're moving to Jonesboro to reinforce our supply lines. If the Yankees cut us off there, Atlanta is lost. That's 50 miles away. You will obey orders, Sergeant, or you will suffer the consequences. Easy, O'Donnell. Our family's homestead is in harm's way, and I'll be damned before I let Sherman's army burn it to the ground. You have your orders. If you choose to disregard them, you will be charged as deserters. Are you threatening me? It ain't a threat, McCall. It's a promise. You tell Colonel Barnsby that we're taking leave to defend our family's homestead. And that we held the line. Right, now get the hell out of here before I take your firearm and shove it where the sun don't shine. Barnsby will put us in front of a firing squad. Only if he catches us, brother. Only if he catches us. Alright, there we go with that mission. Jeez, my accuracy was fucking horrible. 
This is kind of like the end screen to Bounty Hunter. <laughs> where it tells you everything. Um, they do let you pick who you want to play as. So you can like either choose Ray or Thomas. Uh, but the way the collectibles track, it only tracks who picks them up. So I'll probably just stick to playing as one character the whole time. Just to get the secret tracker to not get all screwed up. But... Yeah, so if you've played this game before and you were wondering why it says you're missing secrets at the end of some missions, it could be because you picked some up as Thomas and then some up as Ray, because it'll it'll only count who picked them up. So if you pick four, like if I would have picked four of them up as Ray, it would say four of five, and then if I played again as Thomas, even though you can this level, this is just an example, it would say one of five, even though that would technically be all five. It's really weird and messed up the way they did it. But just for convenience's sake, we'll probably just stick with playing as Ray the whole time, most likely. Because yeah, he's like the revolver user. You can use revolvers with Thomas, but he's like the gunslinger type character. War changes people. Lives are devastated and lost, and families are torn apart. Sacrifice is rarely worth the price. My brothers had to decide between the cause of the Confederacy and the lives of their family. When I saw them with our mother and heard that they had become deserters, I couldn't believe it. But I knew why they did it. For the family. I guess except for in this chapter, because we have to play as Thomas. <laughs> Let's go. Look. I'm just taking in the scenery. The Jackson's cattle. Slaves? Uh, Yanks, probably. <laughs> nice trick. When did you find time to practice? While you were getting old? <laughs> Very funny. Oh, I guess they're both gunslinger types. Can you repeat that trick, smartass? Oh, okay, yeah, I remember that. I actually do like Thomas's concentration mode more. Wonder how you'll do with the Yankees. They hurt us. That's for damn sure. I don't. Can we do? Yeah, I don't think we can dual wield with him. He's got throwing knives though. Here they are. He's running. Hmm. He'll be bringing back some friends. I'll oh, keep practicing, brother. I don't think we can kill him. It almost seems like Thomas reloads a little bit slower too. Son of a bitch. Poor Jackson. Come on, brother. We gotta hurry. Hey, you think our home is torched too? It's only a mile away. I don't have the range. Thanks, nice, brother. Did you hear that? No, we don't have time. That's Jackson. I ain't leaving him to burn. All right, come on. Where is he? Mr. Jackson! Help me! Hold on! We'll get you out! Take that bucket, Thomas! <laughs> ah! Open up! Let oh, me let's out. grab another one just in case. I can't open it! Move aside. What happened here, Mr. Jackson? These animals, they wanted to burn me alive. They killed all the cattle. Slaves? 
No, soldiers. They took over your place, too, and threw themselves a party. What do you mean, took over? What about our mother and William? I don't know what became of them, but there was a shootout. I heard it. Soldiers. Oh, my God. Well, we need to check these stables. I think we actually have another secret inside of the stables. I don't want to kill the cow, though. That stupid animal. You almost joined the others. It's your lucky day, cow. Yeah, there's their secret. Thomas, can you help a brother out? Lex. You put some weight on, brother. <gasps> Come on, get up there. <sighs> Thank you, Junior. Idiot. Come. They can't see us. They got some good cover. It's right through the roof. What? Why is he moving like that? You know what I've learned? That you are one irritating asshole. Damn, that guy's got good aim on me. I seriously somehow shoot a lantern off the wall? Jesus Christ. Are they on all sides? Who the hell are we shooting at over here? We actually have another secret right inside of this place. Why is everything getting lit on fire? I think there's actually two secrets in total in this area, though. had a lot of wisdom in him. Might have been in here. Right. You coming or what? Nope, not this house. There's apparently loot. Nine dollars. Alright, so maybe further down here. Could be this house. Yep, here we go. We got places to go. People to kill. Shut up, Ray. <laughs> and they really like their rusty classic rifles. Alright, they looted enough.
This game is a very bleak color scheme. <laughs> Everything seems so depressing. Jackson, you poor bastard. I don't like this. Gatlin! Run for the field! Where are we going, Ray? Well, I don't think he's gonna follow us with the Gatling. Doc. Stay here, keep your trap shut. I don't like this, brother. How am I supposed to do that if I don't even know where my brother went? <laughs> Oh, come on. Where are they? That all of them? Thought I had more knives than that. Man, Rick could have at least helped when I started shooting. That fire. These blue bellies want to smoke us out. That fire will push us toward their gallon gun. They'll cut us down like cordwood. Shit. Okay. Now you see that tree? You climb it, and you shoot that son of a bitch from up high. Mama didn't like us climbing this tree. We won't tell her, Thomas. We'll just run towards the river. Take that lasso. Okay. Climb the tree and I'll try to keep him busy. That's right, you stupid son of a bitch. I got you in my sights. Come on, you blind son of a bitch! Bullseye. You got him! Hell, I'd say that was a lucky shot. <laughs> Alright, easy enough. There's more coming. Damn it. Well, pardon me for saving your ass. Thanks, brother. Got them all. Still standing. Can I reload this? Yeah. Good. Now let's go home. Yeah, I'm sure it'll be nice and untouched. Oh wow, they killed my horse instantly. <laughs> I feel like I'm playing Red Dead Online. Yeah, sure 
you did. First thing everybody shoots at is your horse. God, they always have to twitch and move around in such odd ways. Something, there we Where'd the other guy go? Jeez, Ray, you coming? The roof's all shot to hell. What happened here? Cannon! Grab some cover! On the roof, we need to get closer. Wait for the roof. Run! While they're reloading! Hide! Now! brother, make them pay. Oh, Jesus. What do you think I'm doing? Whew, that was close. Get some more gun hand. Together on three. Show your face, now. coward. Yeah. That was always so weird because you have to use the left and right That's stick, then the left and right triggers. Oh. From the back. We have another secret coming up here. Or the old lady and the boy die. You hear me? Shit. We actually, Go I think there the might be. Balcony. Yeah, there's we'll another secret right here. Crossfire. We just want to take them and go. No one else needs to die here today. You can go to hell. I ain't gonna ask again. Well, come on then. Come and get them. You coming? Yeah, I'm coming. Oh my gosh. Ma? Is she gone? She died during the night, Ray. She didn't deserve this. I bolted the door, but they broke it down. I tried to protect her, but... You did your best. We can't stay here, Ray. Let's head to the harbor, see if we can find some transportation. What are you doing here, Thomas? Why'd you two come back? Did you desert Thomas? We didn't desert our family. And in this world, that's all that matters. Alright, just seeing if I can pick anything up. You can actually get that secret right now, too, if you still need it. 
William, take cover. The hell are these guys? There they are. Jesus. Of course they have a cannon. Oh man, they're shooting at us from a boat too. He's still shooting at me from there. Oh, I think we got him. I don't know, there's a guy in the roof. How is this guy still alive? Oh, I didn't mean to use this. I always think B is crouch. I mean, they always duck right when I initiate this. That all? Very nice. We should bury Ma. We can't stay here for too long. You hear me, Ray? Ray? We'll rebuild it. After the war, we'll come back here, and this'll be our home again. Looks like we're late to the party. All clear, sir. Goddamn macaws. Look at all these dead blue bellies. And we might have to give them medals for this right after we string them up. I take this as a personal affront. An insult to everything I stand for as a southerner and a gentleman. They violated a direct order. They deserted their unit because of men like them not doing their duty. Atlanta burned. Whether it's tomorrow or five years from tomorrow, those arrogant sons of bitches will hang. There we go. As you can see, Barnsby's going to be a real cool guy in our story. Well, our accuracy improved a bit. It still needs some work. Yep, yeah, that's the end of that mission, from chapter two. Um, I'm probably gonna end this part here, but I'm gonna hit continue because I don't know how the checkpoint system works. So we'll just continue on to the next mission here. On April 9th, 1865, the Confederate Army surrendered to the Union Army at Appomattox, ending the war between the states. The battle was not over for my brothers, however, as Colonel Barnsby had yet to put down his arms and was determined to see them hang. 
Three of us headed west to Fort Smith, Arkansas, a lawless town full of gamblers, drifters, and gunslingers, a place where people knew better than to ask questions. We still hope to rebuild our family farm someday, but for now, that was only a dream. For you see, the war had changed my brothers. They had become cold and violent men who took what they wanted without care or conscience. What you doing? Nothing. We're just having a friendly disagreement. Why is this your business, little brother? Why is it my business? Because I don't want to get kicked out of another town. Well, I don't either. Especially since Thomas here might have a little one on the way. You go to hell. She was mine. Yours? Are you kidding me? What's this all about? Tell him, Tommy. Unless you already forgot her name. Which I doubt, since you just finished screwing her. Betsy ain't none of his business. Betsy? The Marshal's daughter? Are you out of your mind? Little Coquette kept flirting with me. If the Marshal finds out, he oh! is gonna... Get your ass out of here, McCall! I want to know which one of you animals touched my little girl. You! You! Sheriff. What the hell is wrong with you two? You act like the war never ended. And you can just take what you want. But you know what? This time you crossed the wrong son of a bitch. You tell me who did this to my daughter or I will gun down both of you. It was me. He's lying, Sheriff. I did it. Or maybe it was both of us. Oh, shut up, Ray. That girl does like a good time. You're the deputy marshal. You gotta keep your head here. This ain't your business, boy. <laughs> now I'm not the marshal. So let's go. Time to dance with the devil. Ray. Thomas, please. Please. Walk away. There ain't no walking away from this boy. One, two, three. All right, what are their differences here? Yeah, see, Thomas was better with long range, and Ray can dual wield. So I think we're. I think we're gonna go with Ray. Dude, Ray just looks so badass in this game. I always liked that they gave him the metal chest plate. It always looks so cool. Oh god, I forgot how dueling works in this game. Never mind. I remember. Ray! They killed the marshal! Yeah. Alright, but I think ending with the duel is a good way to end this part. I didn't expect to get into this giant shootout. I'm gonna pause it right here. But yeah, I think we're gonna end this part here. But yeah, I, this is always a super fun game. I, like I said in the beginning, I always loved Wild West games. I, I just like the time period, the atmosphere they have, the guns, the themes, the the gun duels. Like, so it's gonna be. I'm looking. I'm looking forward to this marathon. I haven't played. I haven't played the Call of. I haven't played this Call of Wars game in a long time. Uh, and then it's been a while since I played Red Dead. It hasn't been too long. 
because I've beaten the Red Dead series so many times now, but I always look forward to replaying those. But I'm excited to play Gun 2, because that's basically going to be the first time I play it. But yeah, excited for this, so thanks for watching, I'll see you in part 2.